Yesterday we were talking about the pandemic and how it's impacting real estate and I told you today I would have some of the stats for you and the reason is because I'm getting this question by a lot of different people and we serve the, the Central Coast so I'm going to talk about some of the cities on the Central Coast. These are some of the ones that are going to highlight and if it turns out that I'm not covering your city then please reach out to me and I'll be happy to do so. So I'm going to cover some of the top six cities that usually have the most activity in the area. Okay. And um, again, if, you, if I'm not mentioning your city, then reach out to me and I'll be happy to go over it. So in the numbers, and the main reason I'm doing this is because I figure we've always talked about getting the facts, okay? It's not April Fool's Day, it's April Fact Day. I'm, re I'm renaming it. And this is trying to give you accurate information so you can make some intelligent decisions and choices and just sort of get some, some numbers and some data, okay? So Santa Maria, in the city of Santa Maria, that was the top kind of, um, company, excuse me, that was the top city that actually sold as far as between January 1 and the end of March, March 31st, there was 184 homes that sold in Santa Maria and 376,212 was the average um, sale price. So 184, 476, 212. Now here's the thing that I want to drill in. We're in the middle of this pandemic and everything and in Santa Maria currently there are 83 homes available for purchase but we have 118 people that are under contract. That means that we virtually have almost 236 families making movement choices, okay? Even during this pandemic. And this is all, most of this stuff goes under contract the month before. So we'll have those recording. So that's just sort of to give you a hint as to why I'm bringing this to you, okay? I'm gonna jump down and do a couple other cities that are also in the Central Coast. You can sort of see the information there. Lompoc had 93 homes that sold in the um, three month period. Average sale price was 418, 941. Lompoc currently has 46 homes available for purchase and 45 homes under contract. So again, then we'd go, next one is San Luis Obispo. San Luis Obispo had 72, or excuse me, 80 homes that actually sold in the three month period. Average sale price for them was 954,222. So try, try, try saying that to do 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 times, whatever. Um, San Luis Obispo, they have currently 80 homes available for sale and they have 47 homes under contract. The next property area is Arrea Grande, 72 homes. Average sale price there was 775,453. And in the Arrea Grande area currently, they have 70 homes that are active and 37 under contract. Then we jump into Napomo. Napomo has 49 homes that sold in the three month period. 672,657 was the average sale price. And they currently right now have 66 available homes for sale and 25 that are pending. Last city just for kicks and giggles would be Pismo Beach. Pismo Beach had 27 homes that sold in the last three months. Average sale price was $887,351. And currently in Pismo, there are 30 available properties for sale and seven of them are, seven homes are actually actively under contract. So what's that mean? The, that means that people are doing things, okay? I don't know about you, but I mean, if we still have people that are buying and selling and that I find that the people that have opportunities to actually act, not react, are doing so. And they're taking advantage of the different things. They're taking advantage of the low interest rates. People are always going to still need to buy and people are always going to still need to sell. It's just a matter of us doing it a little bit differently. So we've actually done a lot of that. We've incorporated a lot of our standard business practices. We were doing this even before. We're just amping it up. And so if you have any kind of needs or questions or want to know more about stuff, you know, give us a call. I'm callkrista at gmail.com. Just send me a quick text or message and we'll have the discussion. We do a lot of stuff through video. We do a lot of stuff through virtual. We do a lot of stuff through online and we can help you do what you need to do even in times like this. So again, 118 homes that are under contract in Santa Maria. Who would have figured? I hope this you find this helpful. Please share this with your family and friends. Pass this on. Let's get the word out, okay? I know there's still a lot of uncertainty, but at the same time, let's talk about the facts and let's get, let the facts speak for themselves. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. We're going to be doing this every month. I do it in my newsletter. We're going to be doing it now on video as well. And I'm also going to be providing additional information that's based and pertinent on the questions that you're asking me. 
I'm Carl Krista, OIC Real Estate Services, here to help you see your real estate dreams come true. As always, have an amazingly blessed day. Bye.